Hello everyone, this is Gonzalez here. We're here, the BWA Championship, the main event of Hell on Earth 4. And we all know this music. Very similar, very familiar. Yes! Rolling Havoc. Yeah, BW Championship is coming back home to me. As last year, I was voted number one. Damn it, it's gonna be! Calm, calm down, sir. Calm down. But you know, Bullet Havoc, when he was the BW Champion, was the most dominant wrestler of the year. Successfully defeating his title at every show. Truly one of the best in this business to date. Such this thing for the fans. He doesn't care about anyone but himself. Shenanigans, people. Shenanigans. Ladies and gentlemen, you know this music too. Here he comes, our B, the WWE Champion, Matt Armada. This man defeated Jacob Practice to obtain the title. He successfully defended his title against Eddie Brooks. And now he's about to defend it, or he's trying to defend it against the man Roller Havoc. And the main event of the evening, this one-on-one -on -one match for the BEWA title. You don't have a lady to put on your stupid vest. <laughs> Introducing first the challenger. He is a, you pretty much won everything here, right? Yeah. Roland Havoc. <laughs> That's very true. He's pretty much won every last title. There's been a hole in the BWA. This is why he's one of the most dominant wrestlers in this business. The champion. He is the current reigning and defending BEWA champion, Max Armada! Thank you for joining us here, ladies and gentlemen, for the main event of the evening in this BWA Championship contest between the current and defending champion, Matt Armada, who dethroned Jacob Practice, who dethroned Roland Havoc, against the BWA Necessary Evil himself. Close not from rolling habit. Demonstrating his power. A boot in Matt Armada's head. Now Roman Havoc is in control of this matchup, just like he did the match he's in. The big frame, six foot around 300 pounds is Roman Havoc. Wow! 
right out of the corner from the BWA's most accomplished individual. Now you don't, you very rarely see Rolling Havoc going up high. You don't see something you never seen before. Yeah. What are you about to do? Yeah. So, oh, yeah. toying with everyone. Elbow drop. <laughs> Leg drop. <laughs> Two count. Picking up Mount Mata. Standing up. <laughs> Scoop slam. Oh. You only have it working on that arm of Mount Mata. That drops the arm. Pretty badass. That's all. The left arm. <laughs> I'm jealous. Still working on that left arm of Adam Mottis. You have question that Matt, does he want to give up or not? Do you still want to continue? Once again, working on the left arm of Matt Armada. Rolling Havoc is dominant right now. Matt Armada telling the ref he's still in it, not want to give up. And the knee to the shoulder by Rolling Havoc. Throws <laughs> Matt Mott to the turnbuckle. <laughs> Stiff jab to the chin. Irish Church corner. Dodges the close line. Ooh. Matt Armada is taking control. Forearm. Forearm. Diving clothesline. Go for the cover. One. Two. Rolling Havoc kicks out the counter two. Stomp to the back of Rolling Havoc's head. Now, Matt Armada is about to work on those limbs. Rolling Havocs seems to be in a lot of pain from that knee drop to his left arm. Matt Armada working on that left arm again. The ref asking Rolling Havocs, does he want to give up this match? Matt Armada working on that left arm. Something similar to what Rolling Havocs was doing to him earlier in this match. Saying that what? what? Rolling Havoc is fighting a head scissors, a, a pin, shows the depth. Matt Armada gets out of it, another pin, one, two. Matt Armada gets the shoulder up at the count of two. Ooh. Stiff right to the chin of Matt Armada. Uppercut. <laughs> now he's working on the right arm. Ooh, to the shoulder. This body splash. Count one. Two. Maramar gets to show up at the count of two. Again. Ah. She's giving a sleeper hold. Uh, there he goes, locking off that left arm again. 
Matt Armada is saying he's still in it. He seems to be fading. Matt Armada is fading out from this strong sleeper hole by Rolling Havoc. Will he fight out of it? The ref is checking him. That's one. The ref is checking him again. That's two. If it's a three, he loses this match. No. His hand did not drop. Matt Armada still in this match. He's fighting back. Jawbreaker. Matt Armada on the offense now. Picking up Rolling Havoc. Forearm. Forearm. Go for the Irish whip. Reversal. Dodges the clothesline. Calf kick. To the face of Rolling Havoc by Matt Armada. Picking up Rolling Havoc. Seem to be like double axe handle. Two shots to both his shoulders. What is he going for here? Seems to be some sort of suplex. Rolling Havoc stocks it. Russell vertical suplex by Rolling Havoc to Matt Armada. Score for the pin. One, two. And Matt Armada kicks out at the count of two. Rolling Havoc is back on the offense once again in this matchup. Shots to the gut. He's sitting Matt Armada on the rope. What is he doing? He's delivering knees to Matt Armada while he's sitting him on the ropes. Big boot. Matt Armada tumbles off the ropes, out the ring, and onto the outside. Rolling Havoc is showing why he is dominant. Why he is one of the best wrestlers in this business right now. Mamma to the railings. Dark shot to the chest. The ref is telling Roy Havoc to get him back in the ring. Or he will be counted out. Jeff Four. Come on, get him back in the ring, Havoc. Havoc has to get him back in the ring to win this match. The ref is at five. The ref is at six. Rolling Havoc breaks the count. Count starts again. What is Rolling Havoc doing? Ooh! And drives Matt Armada's head into the apron. Matt Armada seems to be out of it. He is choking Matt Armada on the outside with his knee. Rolling Havoc is a dirty fighter, but he is good at what he does best. Ref is at four. Versus suplex. Back into the ring. Ref is at five. Rolling Havoc on the apron. Stomp. Leg drop to the chest of Matt Armada. Back in the ring. You're champion. You're champion. Huh? Rolling Havoc talking trash in the face of Matt Armada. Rolling Havoc once again on the offense. Iris Whip. Dodges the close line. Comes back. Another calf kick with Matt Armada. What is he going for? Matt Armada is going. What is he going to? 
second row, sing on the top row. I've seen it already! Stop! To roll and have it! Here's the cover! One! Two! Roll and have it kicks out at the count of two. After a massive leg drop from Matt Armada. Matt Armada, she's a bit dizzy there. He's working on rolling Havoc. Deliver four arms inside of his head. Close fist at the top of the head of Roland Havoc. He has to keep those hands open. We're going to roll and have it in the corner. And these fans are enjoying this match so much that they are in dead silence. Now they're getting to it, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, what? What's this? Power. Oh, my God. Matt Armada kicks out at the count of two after Rowan having just countered what seemed to be a power bomb from the corner. Another forearm. Ah! Strong forearm. Run to the ropes. Went for a clothesline. It's not bring a roll and have it down. It's going again. Another clothesline. Still doesn't bring roll and have it down off his feet. Matter of going to the ropes again. Big boom from roll and have it to Matter of Matt Armada is down. Rolling Havoc has a chance to capitalize on Matt Armada's mistake. He's arguing with the ref now, which he's been capitalizing on his opponent being down. Knee drop. Another knee drop. Legs up to the right arm. Now he's working on the right arm of Matt Armada. The ref of Axel Maramaris is still in it. He's saying yes. Just a, a slap to the face of Matt Armada. Uh, he's choking Matt Armada with his shin. Why isn't the ref seeing this? Why isn't the ref seeing this blatant illegal move? He is choking Matt Armada with his shin. Now he sees it. Now he sees it. That was not a pen. That was a blatant shit. Yo, I have it smiling. What's this? Neckbreaker. Cover. One. Two. Now Mark is at the count of two. Rolling Havoc seems to be getting frustrated. Back up to Matt Armada is fighting back. Top. Four on. Oh. Oh, try. For rolling having Matt Armada. Go on. Let's go for the pin. One. Two. Matt Armada kicks out at the count of two. A vicious power driver from Roland Havoc. 
Oh, rolling havoc. She's very, very angry right now. Don't touch the ref. You will be disqualified. Havoc, you know this. Look on that left arm again. Maramana. A knee to the left shoulder. Bulldog slam. What's going on to Ron Havoc's mind right now? Probably thinking about what he must do to put Matt Armando away. Double chop to the back. Another double chop to the back. A third double chop to the back. Ropes. This is shit out Larry the Matt Armada. It's cover. One. Two. Oh, Matt Armada kicks out at the count of two and a half. Rolling Havoc is being very, very frustrated right now. Looks like he's calling for the end of this match. He's picking up Matt Armada. What's he going for? What's he going for? Powerbomb! What's he going for? What's he going for? What? A, is this a submission or some sort? No, a pin! Here comes one, two! Matt Armada gets his hand on the rope just in time. Rolly Havoc, don't touch the ref. You will be disqualified. He got his hand on the ropes, man. I will do it. Can't touch the ref, Rolly Havoc. Matt Armada showing his resilience. He gets back to Rolly Havoc. Line. Don't know if he's down. One, two. Matt Armada kicks out again at the count of two and a half. Matt Armada is not giving up. Rolling Havoc is getting frustrated. Probably starting to get desperate. Matt Armada. And what is. You heard it, ladies and gentlemen. Matt Armada survived the vicious onslaught from the man known as Roland Havoc, and he has retained the BEW title in his main event. On Hell on Earth, it's Rock, Rocky Phoenix is out at ringside. Where's Rocky Phoenix doing out here? A slow hand clap. It, it must be the Roman Havoc. Why is he out here? What? Roman Havoc? Oh! They're brawling on the outside! They're brawling on the outside! They're, they're, they're brawling the going backstage! What? 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 It seems Mad Mike has a few words to say. Go in his legs here, guys. A few things I put off my mind. I'm pretty sure some of which is on everybody's mind. What? They call themselves terrorists. They call themselves the biggest threat to the WWE. They call themselves the group of purpose. He, he met BWA, ladies and gentlemen. He's a bit tired. This has been annoying like a fucking tick since day one. Every fucking match is open day, I've had a problem with them. Every fucking match is open day, I've had to fucking deal with ecstasy or royalty, thinking that there's something important. <laughs> I'm glad XC won this match. No offense to ruin, but I'm glad that he's actually going to win. I'm glad that he's actually going to be by himself. And if he's watching, I'm glad because he needs to know that come Legacy, I am going to fucking kill him. I am getting tired of XC. What the fuck does XC stand for? I did. 
He went talk about it, but that should be a long And legacy. I will finally make X and C important. Because at legacy, there will be a fucking funeral here and when he dies. I'll get tired of him playing the PWA. Come legacy. S and C will get a fight. He will get a battle. He will get traded with the respect of being threat. I'm going to beat the fuck out of him. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming out. Have a blessed day. Ladies and gentlemen, the worst from your BEWA champion, Matt Armada, calling out S and C. Well, everyone, we would like to thank you for coming out to hell. On Earth, four. Greg, Greg, thanks for coming, man. Clean up. Greg, see you later, everyone.